Hey guys, Jim Labuda here, Rotary Swing Tour Instructor. Today we're going to work on the third and final installment of my New Year More Power series. I'm going to show you what we've done and take what we've learned over the last two videos and put it together today to show you how to generate more lag in your swing and hit the ball golf ball farther than you ever have before. If you have not watched the first two videos yet, please go back, make sure you watch those first two videos before you work on the things that are in this video. As with everything in rotary swing we need to make sure that everything's done in the proper sequence of events so if you have watched the first two videos if you've done your thousand reps of each move and you're ready to get more lag in your golf swing and hit the golf ball farther than you ever have before let's go ahead and get started Okay guys, so here we are learning how to create more lag in our downswing so we can hit the golf ball farther and more efficient than we ever have before. Now, lag, we all want to have tons and tons of lag, just like all the tour players do. A lot of us even want to get into this Sergio Garcia-esque lag where, personally, I think he's got a little too much lag, but that's a topic for a different day. We all want lag in our golf swing because it's gonna help us hit the ball farther than we ever have before with more efficiency. So how do we do this? In order to do it, we had to start off watching the first two videos. You had to make sure you load up your right side properly and then you start shifting your weight into your left side. As you get to the top of your swing now, what we wanna do is you wanna make sure you've got soft, supple wrists. You can't have firm wrists because the first thing that you're gonna do is your body is gonna to wanna to release the tension. So where's it gonna release the tension? Out this way, you're gonna cast the club, you've lost all your lag. So, how do we create lag and how do we want to feel into the golf swing? Well, I've got a great drill here for you called the downcock drill that's really going to help you feel what you need to experience in order to create more lag in your swing. Okay, as you get to the top of your swing, I want you to get up here and stop. Make sure you feel soft, supple wrists. Okay, make sure you don't have a tight grip on the golf club. Then, as we start to shift to our left side, you're actually going to feel the golf club start dropping towards your shoulders. It's not gonna hit you on the head, it's not gonna hit you on the shoulders, unless you let go of your left wrist and you loosen up that grip. But as we get to the top of our swing, and we start shifting our weight to the left, we wanna make sure we start feeling this move coming down, okay? And this is the down cock drill. We get up here, we stop, and we do this, making sure we feel that, making sure we're doing everything in the proper sequence of events. We're loading up the right side, we're starting to shift the weight to the left side, and then we're letting that club fall towards our shoulders. Now, after you ingrain this feeling and you get used to this by doing this with a thousand reps, you can go ahead and hit golf balls doing this too. But I would start off doing half swings. Again, getting to the top of your backswing, making sure you're stopping up here, starting to shift the weight, feel that club falling towards your shoulders, and then releasing through into the ball. Guys, this is gonna be the simplest and most efficient way to help you hit the golf ball farther than you ever have before and play your best golf ever this upcoming season. Okay guys, so there you have it. There is the final video of my New Year More Power series. I hope you enjoyed the video series. If you did, make sure you click the like button below. Also, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them in the box below. I will make sure to answer any questions as soon as I possibly can or respond to any comments. If you're new to Rotary Swing, make sure you click on the subscribe button below also so you subscribe to Rotary Swing's YouTube channel. Once you click the subscribe button, there's gonna be a bell icon that appears next to the subscribe button. Make sure you click this bell icon also. This way you'll get notified anytime a new video is uploaded to Rotary Swing. Guys, just because you've watched these three videos also, I've included a great bonus video for you below. Click on the link in the description below. Another secret, another tool that's gonna help you hit the ball farther than you ever have before. Make sure you watch it. Let me know what you guys think, check it out. Guys, as always, keep it in the fairway and have yourself a great day.